What's up, 31 fam? How you doing? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, today, man, we got some interesting videos coming up, man. I've been doing a lot of stuff that's not my normal videos, in addition to my normal videos. So I hope you guys are enjoying the content. I'm working really hard to try to bring you guys and gals and dogs, horses, and cats everything that I can that is fun to watch. So I hope you're enjoying it. I really do. Um, yeah. So uh, I did like a little comedy short video. I did like a prank that kind of messed me up a little bit now i got an unboxing for some records this is uh you know we like to do music stuff over here I, i'm a vinyl and and uh well i'm a music enthusiast so i got three packages to open up today show you guys what i picked up and then i'll let you go and i got um actually i got a thing called a humming guru that i'll be doing a video on very soon probably this week i need i want to get it up and up and, and test it but it's a uh what do they call it exactly it's a. Uh, I can't remember the word. My memory is so bad. It's a high, uh, ultrasonic record cleaner. I buy a lot of used albums, so I wanted something that would clean them thoroughly, and it was easy on me. And it's a one-button thing, dude. Like you press the button, it spins the record, it cleans it with the brush, it cl cleans it supposedly thoroughly. And actually, it's not even a brush. It only does the sonic clean. So it spins it, and it's like it, whenever the whenever it shakes a little bit, it bruises bubbles. The bubbles heat up the water, and it cleans out the grooves of the record, supposedly. So I'll be checking it out. It also drops the water and blow dries it for you, all in one button. So we're gonna see how it works. I will do an un an unboxing and probably a test video, and then we'll visit it down the road about six months and see how it works out. So uh, yeah, anybody that like rec that likes records and things of that nature. And I hope you stop by and check it out. Uh, if you want to support the channel and you like what we're doing over here, please let us know. Like the videos, comment on them, and if the most important thing, hit the subscribe button with the notification bell. Uh, like 70% of our viewers aren't subscribed, and I would love to change that. So if you if you don't mind, uh, I'd really appreciate it. And if you want to support us further, you can go down to the description. There's my Etsy and my Patreon in the description below. Uh, we do knife crime apparel, uh, artwork, all kinds of stuff. It's all done by me, hand done. This is all hand screened uh, shirt clothing. And all the artwork is done by me, so check it out if you want to. Also, you guys know if you want somebody to talk to and you don't have that person to talk to, you can always holler at me on my Instagram and I will happily be somebody's friend. Let me find my scissors real quick or something I open this up with. I've got a, a blade around here somewhere. We'll just try this. Let's try this. You know what? That's not going to work. Hold on. There we go. I knew I had to do a lot of crafting. <laughs> I'm such a dork. Whatever. Um, let's start with this big box because I had to open it up because it was like I don't know if you can see this or not, but it was like it was like bulging, right? Like when it was when it was flat, it was bulging up, and I was like, "What in the world?" And so it, it, so I know what's in here because of that. But I think I would have figured it out because the tape on it has Pirates Press logos and stuff on it, so I know what I bought from Pirates Press. So this is pretty cool. So the, what was what was bulging was this. It had a, I bought a cassette tape. Lars Fredrickson's new album, or EP, on uh, yellow. They only made a hundred of these. I got two on pink, they made a hundred of those, and I got one on yellow before they sold out. Um, so what this is, is this is the uh, same EP on vinyl. I got a bunch of them. So, because you know, you guys know I do, a, I have a store, so. So I got some of these for me, some of them for the store. So I'll show you what I got. Uh, let me, let me, let me pull them out. So it's the beautiful, beautiful satin, like flat black. Oh, it's so pretty. And then let's see, which one is this one? Ooh, I can't remember the press number on this, but it's a smoke, smoke, uh, like translucent smoke. I believe it's 150 or something like that, maybe 200. It's a very low pressing, very, very low pressing. I like that whenever, man, especially with his stuff, he's doing good bags he's got the the, the man's great quality stuff why is the why is there is this an etching it goes all the way to the dead wax or something what in the world now i gotta play this dude like all the way to the center there's grooves i wonder why what in the world yo we're gonna have to check that out in a little bit and do a review on it let you know how it sounds son on the inside of this record, you don't only get the album, you get a one sheet, which is very pretty. It's a 12 by 12 print on one side, and then lyrics and thank yous on the other side. Dude, this is quality, quality release, man. This is very, very nice. So thank you to Pirates Press. Thank you to Lars Fredrickson and Rancid, everybody included on this project. Um, I think there's six songs on it. Yeah, six songs. All right, I got 
two of each of them, so let me see if this one's a different color. One for me, one for the store. They're not crazy expensive either, so if you're interested in one of these and you didn't weren't get, didn't get the chance to buy one, <gasps> ooh, check this out. Ooh, buddy. Yes, sir. It's like, it is definitely, uh, you guess you really can't see through it very well, can you? Dude, that is dope. Yo, why is there group? I don't understand what's going on with this record. You know what? Maybe that isn't grooves. Maybe it just looks like it is. Whoa. Man, it's a clean record. That's real pretty, huh? That's what I'm talking about. Son, let's go. Let's, I, don't know, I don't know what are in the other two packages, so I'm pretty psyched. Pretty psyched. So, you guys buying any records these days? What are you buying? Let me know in the description or the description. Let me know in the comments what you're buying, so I can uh, talk with you about it, man. That's a big, large Richardson pur purchase, huh? All right, hold on. Here we go. Oh shit! I split it open. Okay, cool. Okay. Oh, ooh. So this is a uh, nice. This is Amy Winehouse, the remixes. This was a record store day release. Um, man, let's check this out. Let's uh, let's bust this bad boy open and see what the uh, record looks like. Hold on, this has got some damage on it. Man, I'm not gonna open this. I don't want to have to return it. So, sorry about that. I don't want to. It's supposed to be colored, I believe. I may have to get a... There's, there's damage on it, and I'm going to have to probably replace that one, so... Um, shit. Let's see. I don't know what I'm looking for. Alright, let's open this last one up. <clears throat> Alright, okay. See what we got in this last package here. <gasps> Let's go. So, this is the uh, latest Weezer album, I believe. It's called Van Weezer. Um, you guys, if you're familiar with my channel at all, you'll know that I'm a fan of pink. Well, my favorite color is pink, but uh, this is supposed to be on pink wax. So we're about to find out. We're gonna learn today. Let's find out what this looks like. And if anybody's asking what wax means, it just means vinyl. I wonder when that started, pink wax, like calling it wax. Oh, I love opening a record. Ooh, it's such a good feeling. Okay. All right. Ooh! Yeah, buddy. This is my favorite kind of pink record. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh. Yes, bro. What? Oh, you know what? I'm not even going to play around, dude. I'm about to put this on the old record player. Right now. I'm going to listen to it when I get done with this video. That way I can uh, show you guys. Okay, so inside the record jacket, you get the uh, sleeve of the album. And the sleeve has all the lyrics on it on this one. I like, they do that often. They'll put a sleeve in there. Instead of just doing a one sheet or something, they'll make the artwork on the sleeve. And that's pretty cool. It's got, it uh, looks like it's got all the lyrics. You know, all the thank yous and the, all the, you know. What's it called? The, the uh, Like all the album details. All the credits and whatnot. That's awesome, dude. So Amy Winehouse. Uh... You know what? I can't help it, dude. This is a personal record, so I guess I'll have to just deal with the little crease on it. I gotta open it up, dude. Let's see what it looks like. Y'all wanna see? I think this is a double LP, too, so... You know what I wish they would do when they ship albums? I wish people would know how to ship albums, because you're supposed to take it, open it up, pull the record out, and put the record behind the cardboard, and it, it reduces the, 
potential creasing. It reduces uh, splits in the in the jacket. And I'm not by any means an expert on this stuff. I just like records. I collect them. And I, I have a little bit of knowledge on it. And I have a lot of knowledge on music, but very, you know, a little bit on the medium. Oh, shoot. This is crazy. All right. Oh, it is double LP. That's what I thought. Okay. Let's see if this is colored. Ooh, it's blue. Check that out. Oh, man. And it's like see-through. You see? Yeah, that's, that's dope. That is nice. Hell yes. Let's check the other one make sure it's not scratched up or something. That's so pretty. Oh, the second one's yellow. Ooh. Dude, I wonder why they did two colors. I don't remember it saying that on the listing. Sorry, I'm a, I'm a nitpicky ass dude. This is, oh, this is pretty. Y'all gonna be listening to some records today. So yeah, that's what I got in this this uh, mail call. Let me know what you're buying. Are you picking up records too? If you are, let me know what they are. I wanna, I wanna know you guys are out there snatching up on your uh, lunch hours and whatnot. <laughs> um, but yeah, dude, this is great. I like, Amy Winehouse is awesome. Uh, obviously I like Weezer, they're great. And um, the Lars Fredrickson was, that made my day. That's awesome. What a great little haul. Anyways, thank you for hanging out with me for a little bit. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you buy vinyl. Support your bands. Support your artists that you really enjoy. Support local and unsigned artists if they've got hard copy stuff to buy. You know what I'm saying? Uh, next video up on the vinyl end of things would be the Humming Guru one. So, uh, yeah. I hope I see you there. Otherwise, take care of yourselves. Be kind to everyone else, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.